They say we are our own worst critic, and sometimes seeing a photo of ourselves can make us feel bad or hurt our self-esteem. But in today's Mental Health Monday segment, a photographer who teaches people to pose in a certain way that celebrates their strengths. He is the social media king of striking a pose, making a name for himself by meeting a need that is near universal. It's a simple desire of wanting to be seen and be beautiful in photographs. This is David Saw. People come to him to learn to like themselves in pictures. If you've come to a place where you love your body, how I guide you through a photo shoot will be very different for someone who's just starting their self-love journey. Think you're not photogenic? Don't blame yourself. We have to realize it's the fault of the photographer who doesn't know how to photograph us. To confirm, a bad photo doesn't mean you're unattractive. Take a picture of a sunset. Typically, we get a really bright image or a really dark image. A bad photo doesn't take away from the beauty of the sunset. You are the sunset. David says we photograph best when focused not on our features, but on who we are, what we love, and what we want to convey. Nonverbal communication makes up such a huge percentage of how we communicate. You can share yourself through your style, your gestures, or the way you position your body. It's not that you ignore aesthetics, it's that you recognize. There isn't a one size fits all. I grew up in Korea where we have very different beauty standards. Sometimes impossible standards that lead to tension in front of the camera, among Asian Americans in particular. Maybe everyone around them is telling them very bluntly to their face something very negative, and it's taking a toll on the way they see themselves. David realized that to become a better photographer. I need to start learning about things way beyond just photography. Primarily psychology. If someone comes to me and says, David, I feel insecure. He asks, what do you love? What do you want to see? To shine in photos, you don't have to be young or tall or thin or flawless. You just need to be ready to come out of hiding. Yes. And you get to create your identity and like express that. When you learn to communicate yourself and present the way you want to, you can find a lot of empowerment and confidence through that. It's all in the pose. Yes. And who takes the picture? <laughs> I think that's, and the lighting. Yes. It's it's all oh, the, the lighting. lighting. Oh, girl, yes. <laughs>